Hi, it's day to day with St. Joseph. This is Father Barry and it's Labor Day. And we talk about St. Joseph. He's a father who teaches the value, dignity, and joy of work. Does he not? Joseph is a carpenter who, owned, uh, who earned uh, an honest living to provide for his family, period, right? He also teaches the value, dignity, and the joy of what it means to eat bread that is the fruit of one's own labor. And his labor is also caring for Jesus and Mary. This aspect of Joseph's character of his work provides pro Francis the opportunity to launch an appeal in the favor of work, which he's done a few times. Pope Francis, he says, it's a burning social issue, the value of work. Even in countries with a certain level of well-being, we are to have a renewed need to appreciate the importance of dignified work of which St. Joseph is an exemplary person. Uh, Pope Francis wrote this, um, well, he wrote it in many documents. Um, work, Pope Francis says, is a means of participating in the work of salvation, an opportunity to hasten the coming of the kingdom, to develop our talents and abilities, to put them at the service of society and fraternal communion. Those who work, he explains, are cooperating with God himself and in some way become creators of the world around us. What do you think of that? You know, work being a participation in the work of salvation. There's a lot of little things we may not know contribute to the overall good. Uh, we we work to contribute to the well-being of others. There's one of my recent homilies on social justice, about caring for others. I spoke about food and caring for others. And we, we continue with Pope Francis. He says, as we cooperate with God himself and being workers, okay, become co-creators with God, so we're serving him. So the yes, we're serving him, and that's the idea of working. Been on this earth, and it still is always meant to be a work up to God, no matter what it is. Whatever you do, whether word or deed, do it to the glory of God. I think that's from a line in the epistle somewhere. Pope Francis encourages everyone to quote rediscover the value, the importance, and the necessity of work for bringing about a new normal from which no one is excluded. Here we need holy help from Joseph's good intercession and example, he says. Especially in light of rising employment that happened through the COVID-19 pandemic, the Pope calls everyone to renew our priorities and to express our firm conviction that no young person, no person at all, no family should be without work. St. Joseph is a saint we always call upon when needing work. So Pope Francis, when he's thinking of the value of work, of course, it's all related to Joseph and this year of Joseph as we think of Joseph and the value of work as Jesus is alongside Joseph for many years. Joseph and Jesus working as carpenters, as builders, okay? And they have such an occupation that, you know, takes from the wood of the earth and makes it into something of use for man. And they do it for the glory of God. It's amazing that Jesus spent so many years in that occupation. It really is. It's, if if that doesn't show the value of work, what, what would? Though it's a hidden kind of a work, it's hidden years of Jesus. But Joseph the worker and Jesus the worker are certainly uh, an inspiration to us today. And we'll end it short today on, since it's a holiday, 
and have gone along on other shows, but we just consider Joseph as the worker, and we think of work that we do, and we just uh, ask Joseph to help us, you know, to consecrate our day, to consecrate what we're up to, to the glory of God. So he was working and working with wood a lot, working with tools, working with natural things, and just going about his work. We don't know how much it took him away from his family, but we know that in the end he was working for his family, that the work was to help provide for them. And so there was a meaning to his service. There's a meaning to all work, the kind we get paid for and all the other kinds that God asks us to, to respond to and put our energies in. This is Father Barry. Have a good day.